This is the moment, Amen. This is the moment. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I fit it up. Hop in my car and I get it up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car and I get it up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Pick it up. Ooh, I've been on the flex since flex on. Neighborhood all in your eardrums. I ain't never scared like bone crush. Boy, I got God, don't fear none. My line busy, take no calls. What is going on, West Family, aka the best family? Hope you guys are having a blessed and beautiful day. Today is a very, very special day. Today is our little angels, our little sweetheart, Papa G's favorite, Emin, our little sister. Her graduation today a little different though because they're gonna be like a drive-through graduation. So we're gonna we're going to go get the car decorated, putting flowers on it, balloons on it, like typical Pakistan style, the way they do with the whole flowers and whatnot. We're gonna see what we do. But Papa G and I are on an adventure to go ahead and decorate her car. All right, y'all, we are starting the process of putting the flowers on the car. Let's see how it turns out. All right, y'all, we are done wrapping the flowers, Pakistani style. Well, somewhat. They don't really do that out here in the States, but let me go ahead and show you guys the yeah. City lights are making me wanna be Something else that I'm meant to Spending time reminiscing of what it used to be Not letting go We got the flowers out, but now there's a problem. We can't really see. Papa G can't see that much when he's driving. Hopefully, we can get these home safely. The funny thing is, everybody's like looking at us. The problem is, like in Pakistan, this is so normal. When it's a wedding or any type of occasion, you literally dress the whole car in flowers. This is nothing. It's just funny how this is not normal. Oh, we got a stunt out for our baby girl, Amen. She is daddy's little favorite. She's a daddy's little girl. That's why we're out and just did all this. So hopefully, we can get this back safely, man. We are running late as usual for a Kona graduation in our car, but we. <laughs> the miest ever I see you guys do not have any timelines or preparation okay. or anything. Anyways, Mama no, G, no, we're the wearing all white. The, the grad, the grad is here, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, Amen, let's go. The grad is here. It's looking good, mashallah. I love the colors. And Amen here, this is what we did right now. Look at that, look at that. Nope. We're gonna start basic. Hey, 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 Thank you very so much. We are going to miss this beautiful school too. Thank you so very much for all the services you do today for him. We're going to put everybody on the culture. Amy, are you embarrassing you? This is the moment, Amen. This is the moment. Alan, yeah. Abraham, Mon Hey, what's up, man? Hey. Looking good, looking good. Actually, looking good. <laughs> It's so good to see you. It's been so long. It's been so long. Hey, Amy. What's up, you doing? This is it, Amy. This is the moment right here. Amy, my mood. Yeah! Amy! Yeah! Yes, Amy! You go, girl! 
Thank you guys. Hey, man, we're below. Oh my God, I see you, sir. How you guys doing, sir? Oh, so, 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 so. How are you doing? How are you doing? Courtney. Oh my gosh, how you doing? Good to see you. We stepped out of the car. We're gonna go and enter the school to take some pictures. And I haven't entered these hallways. Keep in mind, me and Amma that went to this high school and Evan's the last one to graduate from here. These halls bring back so many memories. Oh my God, this is wild. Haven't been in these hallways since Amma. How long? It's been so many years. So Amma went here. I went here. Mama, how do you feel so that Evan's the last one? Yeah, this woman is the last one, and this is the legacy. This is the place this I is love. So crazy. A door, and it is so close to my heart. This campus, the memory will go with me forever How does when it I feel die. That now, Amen is the last one to leave this place. I know. First, it was Amon, then me, but and I'm now so Amen's the final one. Let me tell you, people, crazy. I'm so proud of you. These two boys, everybody knew them, and everybody cheered Legacy. their name when we were passing, driving through for graduating her. They make me so proud at this moment. I said they are dummies, but I'm okay now. Okay, what about Amen? So proud. The I think she continues. is going to achieve the highest level of education in my family. Only if you do what? Only yeah. if you what? Flip the switch. Y'all heard it here first. Flip the switch, ladies and gentlemen. Always and forever. All right, y'all. We have made it to Cheesecake Factory for Eamon's graduation dinner. I am starving. Me and Daddy all day have been trying to do your car thing. We haven't eaten all day. You Don't happy? Worry. Get the food. Well, you know Chubby West when he gets cranky. But how yeah. you feeling? How you feel being graduated? I know it's a little different because of COVID. Actually, it was cool, right? Yeah. The graduation wasn't that bad. Yeah. Every single person was on their phone. You just put it down. She's on his phone. That Mama G's on his phone. Amazon's on his phone. This is disgusting. This is disgusting. Mama, we should have your phone. I'm not going to phone you for Everyone put their phones down. I ate too much. All right, anyways, guys, we are at the end of this vlog, but before I do that, I'm gonna have everybody one by one sit in the hot seat and say a few words to Eamon, give Eamon a message, and we're gonna start with none other than the beautiful, the queen, the mother. Mama G, please take a seat and give your message to Eamon. Hello, my baby doll, my baby girl. I remember since the day you were born, you were so pink, so beautiful. I'm so, so, so proud that you came long away in learnings and with everything that you have achieved. Cannot imagine the future is holding for you. Good things, the best thing, lucky things, love, respect. You have already earned my love since the moment you were born with your hard work and the way you have become such a beautiful, accomplished young lady. Love you, Lord. Love you to the moon and back. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give you a happy, long, healthy life. What's up, man? Kya hal chal hai? Best of luck and good luck. Be, you know. <laughs> Amy, that's it. That's all you're gonna get from Papa G. Best of luck, Amy. That's what you're gonna get. Okay, I think good job. <laughs> Man, a few words, but every single word matters when it comes from Papa G. Just remember that. Hey, Amy, how you doing? Man. You are growing up very, very fast. I can't believe that you are graduating high school and I still see you as an eight-year-old little baby. You work really hard. You have a higher GPA than both of us had. You're very independent. You are just a go-getter and you don't let anything faze you. That is, I think, one of your best traits is how independent you are and how you don't need somebody to do your work. And that will take you a very long way. And I'm excited to see what you're gonna be doing in the future. And of course, you have myself and Vaji for all your support and literally everything. So you have a little bit one leg up in anything that you want to do because you'll have our full 100% support and we will get you whatever you want. That being said, take over the world, have hope, have a vision, and you know, just keep on going. You got this in me. I'm gonna keep it short, I'm gonna keep it simple. Eamon, you already know what I'm gonna say. It's time. 
you already know it's time to what? It's time to flip the switch. Listen to me. High school is just one small step in your long, long, long journey. Remember, it's a marathon, not a race. Remember that, all right? Forget about whatever happened. Forget about the past. Forget about what could have been. Forget about what has been, what you've done. Focus on the now. And I know with your hard work, with your work ethic, you have the work ethic. It took me around this time after senior year when I graduated and I really flipped the switch and I had that mindset. I set my goals and I was able to do it. I know you have it in you, all right? Forget about what's done. I want you to work so hard for the next couple of years, whatever it may be, achieve your goal. There's not gonna be any rooms for what if. You're gonna work 110% and I know you are. The whole idea of, oh, I could have done this, or what if this happened? Forget about all that, amen. It is your time right now. Focus on the now. Put your hard work and passion to whatever it is you wanna achieve. And I know, and I know, and I know, inshallah, you'll be able to. We're gonna look back at this video. I'm gonna ask you, did you flip the switch? Matter of fact, I'm not gonna ask you. I'm gonna look back and be like, wow, you did it. You flipped that switch. Love you so much. Um, means the world watching you grow, and I can't wait to see what else in store, inshallah. I love you, love you, love you so much. As always, much love. Stay blessed, and always, always, always stay beautiful. You know me. I don't want to die for them to miss me. Yes, I see the things that they wishing on me.